Hey guys, how's it going and welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. Now today we are reacting to another clip from Would I Lie To You and this one is called Greg Davies and the Snorkel Parker Music Practice Room. So once again another crazy title which at this point is impossible to decipher. But this was recommended to me by Lynn Walsh, thank you very much for the recommendation. And yeah guys, Greg Davies, he's... I've been seeing a lot of him in Taskmaster, so it's going to be a very different chain scene and one would I lie to you, but yeah, very much looking forward to getting into this one guys, and if you guys do enjoy this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and also leave me a recommendation, something to react to on would I lie to you, but yeah, without further ado, let's get into the reaction. And here we go guys. At school, I invented a game called Snorkel Parker Music Practice Room. Sure. Okay. Uh, please, team, what do you think? What was the game called again? Um, <laughs> Quickly glances down. It was down. called Snorkel Parker Music Practice Room. What a name. Right, and can you describe the game to us? Myself and um, several friends, uh, uh, we all had Snorkel Parkers. What, what is a Snorkel yeah. Parker for some, for some of the younger viewers? It's got to be it's, um, it's one of those. It's a large uh, that hooded like. coat with a fur-lined Oh, collar. the one that comes out at the front. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. and you can, you can zip it up so that it comes right up and uh, so that only your eyes are visible. Can you describe the rules? Imagine we've never met, I've got my snorkel parker. <laughs> what would happen next? Well, then you and I, Lee, will go to the music practice room when... I'm not um, falling for this again. <laughs> and you zip up your snorkel parker, yeah. and then you, you... When someone's practising their violin with a violin teacher in the music practice room, yeah. you duck down b below the window, and then you just come up with your snorkel parker. <laughs> so just the eyes are so visible. Just imagine you're a historical reenactment society. <laughs> You've got your members there. I suppose. I suppose. How I, would you? I'd want? have to fully demonstrate it by using my um, making an ad. Feel free to ask parker. Richard and David to help you out on this. Will you help me out with this? Um, well, I mean, I, 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 you see, this is one of the moments where. <laughs> Okay, so everyone's getting involved now. All right. Ah, oh, this this group is an incredible group. Greg, David, Richard, and then we got Bob Moore. Ah. Oh. So, if, so if you imagine that this was Lee as well, of course. Room, and, and there was some someone in there having a lunchtime a lunchtime violin. <laughs> this yeah. looks amazing. You, you wait until they were in mid tutorial, and right, then I'm here we go. And then together, yeah. after three. Okay. Yeah. One, two, three. Four. <laughs> oh, that's it, really. That he looks amazing. Forget the fact that they never knew who you were because you no, they wouldn't know who you were because there's only your eyes showing. And he'd tell you to go away, so you would all duck down away, and then you'd leave it for a minute, and, and then straight up again. up again. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe. Tell me you weren't one of the teachers. <laughs> now, maybe 13, 14. Right the way through to when you left? Right, right through till sixth form, yeah. You, you never got told to stop this, or you got to... Yeah, well, they, would, they would bang on the window and be really furious with us. For five years, they were banging down. on the window. <laughs> <laughs> they never thought to come out. <laughs> no. <laughs> it's getting really boring. <laughs> but you I, see... I know you are, Greg, because you're eight foot six. <laughs> <laughs> Just that's, a, that's a good point. Of hands, who would like to play Snorkel Parker music practice? Big really? time. Big time. Yeah. Big time. I'm quite keen on I've, the game. I've already played it. I didn't really enjoy it. <laughs> oh, David, mate. You just need to get into it's it. It's ridiculous. I mean, the last it time... It does I... sound utterly ridiculous. Go. It's almost as if you're lying. <laughs> Do you think he is lying, Lee? What are you going to say on this? Here we one? go. So now, the thing with this, this is one of the ones that I want to be true more than anything. But I feel like Lee has picked up on something here. If you're doing this for a period of five years, would the teachers not recognise your coat? Or would you not get spotted during this period if this was a continual thing? Like, this is one which I want to be true more than anything, as the game looks hilarious. And when they all popped up, <laughs> that was like the best thing ever. But like Lee said, I feel like you'd have got recognised. I feel like if you do it enough times, the teachers are finally going to do something. I feel like it's false, and he's told it extremely well, but I want it to be true. But I think it's false. Let's see what it is. Well, I, I actually believe him. I could just see you doing that for, for kicks and giggles. Bob, which way are you leaning with this? Well, it's got the anticipation, it's got the jeopardy, it's got the <laughs> yeah, lot. It's got it all. Something's up me, you're going to get a phone call. 
phone call from Waddington's. <laughs> if this gets picked up, this is just because I've talked about it now, it's mine, right? It's only yours yeah. if you really played it. If it's a lie, then you haven't copyrighted well, who's it. If it is a lie and I've just read it off this thing, whose idea is it? But well, the, I'm the person who wrote the lie. Mm. <laughs> I'd, like to, I'd like to maintain the rights to Balaclava Sports Hall. <laughs> 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 yeah, if anyone's interested. <laughs> right, Lee, it's time to take a guess. What are you going to say? We're going to change, that would be a great okay. game as well. Uh, Greg, were you Here we the go. Truth? Well, or were you telling well, me? Well, right, because that would make me utterly pathetic, wouldn't it? Yes, I was telling the truth. <laughs> wow, and there you go. Well done. Yes, well true. done. Uh, Greg did invent a game called Snorkel Parker Music Practice Room. At school, Greg was very popular with the other pupils. Not surprising, really, considering they'd created him in a science lesson. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. That was good. So, it was true in the end. See, this was one which I thought I wanted it to be true, so I'm really happy it is true. I just... Like Lee said, I feel like you'd have got recognised and stopped within this long period. But no, it was true, and he does this. And guys, just give me one second. I feel like I'd be quite good at the game. <laughs> oh, God. But yeah, guys, if you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe. And remember, if you have any more recommendations, let me know. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow. Actually, I will see you guys later tonight for the next Taskmaster video. Peace.